<laughs> Ibanez GWB 1005. GWB 1005. All right. Gary Willis model. This is the big dog, the uh, handmade Japanese version. Treble and bass, boost and cut. Okay, it's stacked. The treble and bass is stacked. Stacked. I see. Volume, which pulls to go to passive. Okay. Very nice. Wow. Single Bartolini. And it's kind of cool. The ramp is actually, the way it's set up right now, it's level with the fretboard. Okay. So you can literally play on up past the fretboard. Wow. You know? I mean, it's, it's all fretless, huh. but, you know, bolt-on neck, nice and punchy. Wow, man. Gary's signature? Gary's signature. Gary's specially designed tuning Oops. pegs. Okay. They're kind of nice. The nice wow. thing about the tuners, I think it's really cool, and, and he talks about this, is you don't have to cut your strings. He's made the post bigger. Had Ibanez or whoever mm -hmm. designed the tuners, it might be Godos, uh, so that you don't need to trim the ends of your strings. You just pull them out of the package and stick them on there. There's plenty of uh, peg there to hold it all. Well, so this is this is the bass with the uh, control step flat. Nothing boosted or cut. So boost the bass about halfway. Get some nice low end all the way up. So no bass, all bass. Warms it up nicely. And then put that flat treble. That's all the way up. Yeah. Probably huh. not really realistic. And then all the way off. Back to flat. So nice, you know, it's, I kind of like it a little bit of bass boosted, treble mm -hmm. cut. A little fatter, warmer sounds. boosted a little bit that's the bass boosted halfway and treble cut about half. okay how about passive no passive tone or anything on here no effect well, actually, it's a pretty good level on it though i, I kind of dig the passive. yeah it sounds you know? good it's very organic and uh, there's not a big huge jump in volume either because usually well here's here's active Here's passive. Wow. Actually, it almost seems a little louder in passive yeah. right here. Are you cut with the bass or trouble? Or, no, huh? Straight bass up. and trouble or flat. So wow. Active, passive. Yeah. That's almost a rarity going from passive to active because usually the passive is so much lower. Right. That's pretty cool. Low B is great. And this is passive. Now the action's really low on this. Yeah. These are tape on strings, so they, you know, they tend, they're a little looser, they tend to vibrate a little okay. bit. Okay. But I think low B is great. up high is really nice you get all the way up there to the except for my intonation <laughs> it's tough up there it's very sensitive. 
You mostly play over the uh, pickup. I guess so, yeah. A little more attack down there, tighter strings. But the ramp matches the pickup shape as well, so kind of should feel very natural. Cool. 